In 2009, President Barack Obama set forth an ambitious global agenda to secure all of the world's nuclear material. If we are serious about stopping the spread of these weapons, then we should put an end to the dedicated production of weapons-grade materials that create them. The following year, President Obama hosted the first Nuclear Security Summit in Washington, D.C., bringing together heads of state from nearly 50 nations. This evening, I can report that we have seized this opportunity. And because of the steps we've taken as individual nations and as an international community, the American people will be safer and the world will be more secure. Industry leaders from every region of the world also gathered in Washington for the first Nuclear Industry Summit. In 2012, leaders from 36 countries gathered in Seoul for the second Nuclear Industry Summit. And two years later, 53 countries were represented at the 2014 Nuclear Industry Summit in Amsterdam. Together, these summits achieved significant results. The removal of highly enriched uranium and plutonium from 16 countries and more than two dozen nuclear facilities. Minimized use of highly enriched uranium through the conversion to low enriched uranium fuel in research reactors and the expansion of low enriched uranium targets for radioisotope production while ensuring a continuous and stable supply of these much needed radiopharmaceuticals. Nuclear technology and materials play a vital role in our lives. Nuclear energy accounts for more than 11% of the world's electricity and is an essential means of reducing greenhouse gases and diminishing the threat of climate change. The use of irradiation to preserve food is growing and millions of patients are diagnosed and treated with nuclear imaging and medicine each year. The progress we have witnessed is real, but the threat remains and the stakes are high. That's why we are committed as an industry to manage the cyber threat, secure the use, storage, and transport of strategic nuclear and radiological materials, and shape the vital role of the nuclear industry in the 21st century. Together, we must maintain the safety and security of nuclear technology. This is a prerequisite to sustaining a balanced energy supply, protecting our environment, and improving the quality of life for billions of people around the world. That is our opportunity as we open the 2016 Nuclear Industry Summit.